I think we're gonna make it. But, uh, we're getting down there. All right, so we're driving down Highway 15, coming up on Thompson, and uh, <laughs> we might make it there. I think we will. It looks like we'll be able to fill up with gas. Hallelujah. Well, she's a thirsty one today. Look at this pizza, it's huge. It's like ginormous spicy pie where you can draw on the walls and do whatever you want. I just thought it was funny, I'm sitting here had to buy an air conditioner. And here it is, in my car. Safe, I'm safe, I got it. So, should be good. You know, the medical world is really cool. I have flat feet, and how we used to make arch supports were you'd lay down on a table, I remember this as a kid, you'd lay down on a table, and they would take like whatever you make like pinatas out of and they would slap that on your feet, let it dry, take that off and use it as a mold to pour plastic or whatever into it to make these really bad arch supports. But it was all I had. I used to have blisters all the time. I couldn't even walk up a flight of stairs. I'd be in so much pain. Well, anyway, uh, for the past few years, there's been this thing. I can't remember. It's like a goofy machine. It's at my chiropractor. Stand on like this, this glass. Which is really scary because it's like a box and you can see through this glass and you're like, you want me to stand on this? Well, I'm scared. I hope my foot doesn't crash through. Stand on it, scans your foot, and it gives you this. So here's a normal foot. Um, this is like the pressure points. Um, the red is the extreme pressure points. That's a normal foot. Here's my freak feet. Some giant size 17 goofy feet. See, I got flat feet. This one has a little more flatness than I have a pinch of, just a pinch of arch in there. Once again, that's the, that's the, how it should look. And here's how my feet do look. And uh, because of that, it can throw off my body to be a little bit crooked. So what is the new family member's name? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to name it. It's a pure white. Is it a boy? I don't know. Like, the thing with parakeets, the thing on top of their nose, it'll turn blue if it's a male and kind of like a tan if it's a female. But with albinos, you don't have that. Oh. So it's kind of hard to say. And it's too young to tell anyway. You're some transgender freak. No. We'll just call him Cyrax. Oh. Wow. Sweet? It just popped on your finger yeah. like that. Has a little ankle bracelet. Yeah. He's an alcoholic. How old is he? Uh, two months old. We have a birdie. Did we pick a name yet? I like the name Duffy, but I don't know. Uh -oh. Alright, so now we're going to make some poopsicles. They're little poop emojis. And you put root beer in them. I'm going to use this kind. Oh, sorry. Oh, mm. And they got little poop poop emojis on it, and you put root beer in, and you make your popsicles. And you can get these at Walmart for like a buck seventy four or whatever. I don't know; they kind of work. Thank you. What do you got over here? There's a bird on my shoulder. Wow, you're like a pirate. 